really important to have moments in your life when you're reminded how small you are. We're all just this one player that exists among many. We came to Newfoundland all the way from San Francisco to see a totally new place to experience what the local business community is doing and see what innovation looks like here. My name is Dan Kurzrock. I'm the co-founder and chief grain officer of Regrand. We take the grain that's already used to make beer and we turn it into food products. I've become obsessed with this idea of upcycling, of this idea of looking at natural resources and improving the way that we value them. Jenna's my wife. Our favorite thing to do is travel the world and experience new things together. Before coming to Newfoundland, I'd heard about John Norman, who is the youngest mayor this island has ever had, and he was willing to come out and show us around. Newfoundland and Labrador is very unique. Well, you know about the icebergs that go by eastern Newfoundland every spring as they come down from Greenland, and they go right by here, right by St. John's, right by Bonavista, and we make products out of them because it's pure water, uh, really high quality pure water. We have a number of businesses that are tied to the sea, tied to icebergs. You're gonna visit a few of those. Water is one of the most unsung heroes of beer making. And so one of the coolest things about the Kitty Vitty Brewery is that they are using icebergs as an ingredient in their beer making process. Walk into a beer tasting with three beers from Kitty Bitty Brewery, and we're gonna start with our iceberg lager. This is made from 20,000 year old iceberg water. The real benefit with using iceberg water is it froze up to 20,000 years ago, and this is kind of before man had any impact. There's nothing in it except yeah. just pure H2O. So what you get is a super crisp, yeah, clean super lager. Crisp. Cheers. After meeting John at the brewery, he brought us a few hours away to his hometown of Bonavista. Bonavista's gone through a real renaissance. People are doing very unique things and becoming export businesses in this small rural area. Welcome to the Newfoundland Salt Company. This is actually where the salt is made. This will take about six to eight days in these pots. So you start from this way and just give it a little push. Really and the water great. will pour out slowly. Look at that, you're a natural. Big <laughs> chunk <laughs> <laughs> we This is tree line, fine art and craft. And oh, here's Morgan. Jen. Hi, nice to meet you. This is my store. I use the Newfoundland Salt Company salt as a fixative for my iceberg dyed scarves. Oh yeah, look at that. So this is East Coast Glow. The products inside are really tied to the local region. You can smell it, the spearmint, the peppermint. We forage as much as we can from land and sea. And of course, iceberg water is a huge part of what we do. Our goal is to be the purest cosmetic company in the world. Seeing a place like Bona Vista, there is such a focus on the natural resources. It's an example of innovation that I find super inspiring. There's so much synergy that they find with each other, using each other's products, creating a real sense of community. <laughs> the next morning, I had the chance to go see the icebergs up close. One thing that is just abundantly clear is how much natural beauty exists and how much more there is to explore. We are seeing chunks of ice that are 10,000, 20,000 years old. It's awe-inspiring. It's a feature that is seen in so few places in the world. Never seen anything like this, that's for sure. Well, I'm really glad I could take you out and you could experience a Newfoundland iceberg. It's something that so few in the world get to do. Uh, super special, thank you, John. That for me is something I will remember for the rest of my life. Coming home from this, I feel really energized to take Regrand to the next level and craft this business that we're trying to build.